Hello. Hi, good morning. Good. Thanks for joining us today to tell us all about what you're up to with your learning with your students. Maybe you could tell us uh, where you teach and what grades you teach. We're both at Raymer and we teach a grade two, three combined group. Can you tell us um, why you're choosing to integrate learning for your students? We, yeah, we started off keeping it a bit more separated and then we found that our, the next unit we wanted to look at was community and right now it's kind of a tough time because they're not really able to immerse themselves into the community as far as any businesses go. So we just started looking at what I think what kind of piqued our interest and Kim had remembered a really neat book that Adrian Beer had recommended. It's Mama Built a Little Nest. And we just, we went from there and it, it was non-fiction. It, um, we, we engage, we uh, challenged the students to, to build their own nest. And then we brought that into some writing, um, how to writing. So uh, yeah, I think we just, just really encourage the students to get out, to enjoy nature, to appreciate the nature around us. And they flew with it. They had a blast. What do you think it is about connecting the learning for kids that makes it exciting and, and, and manageable for them? I think right now too, like we're right in the season where we're just getting our leaves on. So we challenge the students to go outside and find birds nests. You could see them everywhere because the, the trees were bare. So it was local. It was something they could actually see. Um, we found two uh, cameras, local cameras, like an Osprey and an Eagle camera, so we put those up so they could actually look at these on a daily basis and then again, it gets them excited, something local and, and that's real and tangible. I think Kim and I were so excited about this project that we emulated like, wow, look at all these really cool things outside and they actually kind of, they jumped on the bandwagon right with, with both feet. Yeah. My son and I were walking down the street one day and he pointed out a nest to me and then I, uh, that's what kind of triggered the memory of um, Adrian Gear's book, How to Mama Built a Little Nest. And I started to tell him about some, how some birds actually make their nests out of spit. And he thought that was really cool. And um, we just wanted to continue to develop their curiosity and get into our community. So we couldn't do that with them. So we, we tried to encourage them to do that. And we knew that was something that their families could do without a lot of paper and pencil. And if they are doing that already, um, we wanted to encourage that.